So in early March 2020, we took a group of students on a bus. We travelled south and we headed to Perthshire. Our destination was Comrie Croft so that we could do a live build exercise. Comrie Croft is one of these great places that has landscape and camping and activities and this forest around about it was, was great at that time of year. And they have these katas which are sort of tumbled through the landscape. Tents that you can sleep up to six people in, they're, they're fabulous. And the project that they asked us to look at was these outside cooking areas to be attached to the tents to allow people to cook while they're staying in them. So we set the students up with a task, go out and survey, look at the various sites, measurements, drawing little plans and see how we can just adapt the form, the shape, the function to how people can use each of these sites. There was a lot of sketching that went on. It was a nice day so they managed to draw outside in the forest. And because of where we were staying there was a lot of possibilities to sit about and do group work. And the students developed up different ideas within small teams, all working in the one place. It was noisy and frenetic, pretty much what a studio should be. So this is a quarter four, um, which is the one that, that, that kind of raised up as a raised deck with it, and um, you can kind of overlook the dining area as of the current moment. Um, we had an idea of, again, like similar to other groups as well, having a kind of fabric sort of roof that's connected to the existing, and then having a continuing on the deck, and then having framed views between the trees, and then continuing having a seating area that goes towards the fire pit and makes it a very flexible sort of space. It's not just like a square kind of deck, we've kind of made it fit in with the side. Right, the so yes, yeah, so we've yeah. looked where the trees are and where kind of the drops are, so that it kind of like flows from the path up towards the street. So all the ideas were presented to the crofters and they chose certain elements of them. The social aspect was a big thing within the trip and the students just came together, they cooked for each other, they uh, played games, we had a quiz night. Um... And then using hand tools, the, the students put their vision into place. Some of them had to develop new skills, some of them had to think laterally about how things go together, but they all worked together as teams to produce these uh, finished kitchen uh, units, worktops. Not the biggest of schemes, but the results were really quite impressive for, for three days.
Okay. In your, in your own time. <laughs> Wait, one more. <laughs>